of play underway running at the end of the month until the end of the month of the Yale rep called Escaped Alone. It features four actresses around the age of 70. We're going to see older actresses in a play. Just think of the wisdom on that stage. It's a short play about 55 minutes. Three old friends and a neighbor in a garden. It includes tea and catastrophe. My guests are cast members, actresses, Rita Wolf and Latanya Borsay. Welcome to you both. Thank you. Hi. Thank you for having us. Okay, well, let's start with you, Latanya. How did this play come to be and how is it that you got involved with it? Because you're not 70. <laughs> well, not 70, but I'm not 20 either. Well, you don't have or, to tell. Yeah, I won't. I won't. I won't. <laughs> but I'm not ashamed of it. But um, how I got involved is in it because I've worked with the director before, Liz Diamond, who's phenomenal and a great mind and a great creative. Um, and she called me in to audition, actually. And I didn't even have to do a callback, which is what you get you sure. know the next time if they're interested in I just went in that first time because we have worked together before and then she just you know made the offer and yeah, there you so. are Rita you're not yeah. 70 either but no you know. no we are the spring chickens yes. yeah. Yeah. Okay. and we're not we that spring so <laughs> and we ain't and we ain't that spring <laughs> either we're, we're good at this spring. place so how is it that you found yourself in a play about 70 year old old friends well uh, I think it's um, to do with the nature of the work as you can hear I, I have an English background. I was raised in London, in the UK, and the play is for English women. Uh, for English women. The tea? Yes. yes. For English women in a garden in the southeast of England. And so I think Liz was looking for actresses whose work she knew, who were of a particular age, and who could, and I have to say, Latonia is knocking it out of the park every night, uh, who, could, who could play English characters. What do we learn from this backyard in a garden with friends talking? Well, I, I think what we're learning about is the power of community uh, and the need for it and how it is in our society where there's so many uh, things in it that's, you know, full of turmoil and challenges because life is just filled with that throughout time. But that it's the community that comes together and uh, to to help you to endure and even perhaps even thrive in life, you know? So I think that's really ultimately what the play is about. Rita, do these friends really get to the core of each other or are they skimming the surface or do they get there? That's such an interesting question. Um, yeah, I would, I would agree with uh, Latonia's last comment about community and endurance and women of a certain age with the accumulated, accumulated experience of that of those many years. When I think sometimes about the years of experience that we have on that stage with the four of us, we're into hundreds of years, you know, it's mm -hmm. extraordinary. So uh, in addition to that, the question, as old friends, what do we talk about and what are we unable to talk about? Mm -hmm. what, are our what are our personal experiences, which even having close friendships, mm -hmm. These things are difficult for us to say. They're too personal, and each of us has them in the show. What's the biggest surprise about you being in this that you've taken? What has, has really impressed me is the range of ages that respond to this work. Mm. We had a school's, uh, a large school group, a uh, high school group, yesterday afternoon who loved it. And the, and the students at Yale who come love it too. And people of our age and older love it equally. Thank you both. Thank you. It's Thank good you. to always talk. Yeah. With old friends. <laughs> Good to if, you, yes. if you would like to know more about Escaped Alone at the Yale Rep Theater in New Haven, go to WTNH.com or the News 8 app.